What do you ask to get the answer to the following question? What is considered a good chess rating? In this video, we're going to be talking about three different sources to answer this question. Number one, yourself. Well, to be honest, your answer can be changing all the time depending on where you are in your experience of chess, your growth period, your rating currently, and the state of mind you have, whether or not you're sad, frustrated, maybe you talk down about yourself saying, I can't be good. I lost every single winning position I had this month. Or maybe you have a high self-esteem and say that I've been really doing well in the tournaments that I didn't have this month. So therefore my rating should be a good rating, wherever that is. So do you mark your results about tournament results? Is it about your dominance between you and the other chess club members? Or is it based on your experience? So basically you're playing about 40 years of chess and therefore your experience says that you have a good rating, whatever that is. So now let's talk about the second source, which is myself, NASA Master Metal Legal. So I'll go back to the root, the beginning of my chess playing. On the offset, I thought the 1500 rated players were the good players. Basically the compass is the players that win the most tournaments in the youth department. From now, I've seen the path I traveled from the mountaintop to go NASA Master, and I think that now that good players are about 1800 feet a day. So again, it's a sense of relativity. At the beginning, I was only a beginner, and now I'm a NASA Master, so my opinions have changed. And the third source is actually opinions of the Grandmaster. So I have two chess Grandmaster friends that ask this question. What ring says a good chess player? And I got two responses. One from a Grandmaster friend from Australia, Max Illyworth. And he says, for beginners, 1000 is a good rating. But for co players, 1800 plus is a good rating. For masters, it's basically 100 points above where they currently are. And the other Grandmaster, Zavin Andrasian, says 2200 is okay after two years. So you can think about it as like a choose your own adventure game. You can do source one yourself, source two me as a chess coach, or three as a GM, and maybe a fourth option is wherever you want it to be. And furthermore, if you want to know the tone concepts that every good chess player should know, there's a link in the description of a video on my channel that talks about that. <laughs>